It's a beautiful day in this neighborhood, a beautiful day for a neighbor. Would you be mine? Could you be mine? It's a neighborly day in this beauty wood, a neighborly day for a beauty. Would you be mine? Hey, everybody. Could Welcome to the Stock mine? Report. Hey, you know what? Today was such a good day. I think we need a little more. All right, so it is a beautiful day, is it not? I feel good, and I hope you feel good too. Why is it such a beautiful day? Well, if you've been following anything that I've posted, I don't know if there's a single video aside from one or two that I have not talked about Palantir. And in fact, my most viewed video on this channel is the video that I dedicate five reasons why you should pay attention to and buy Palantir. And I am bullish. And I'll even tell you this. Somebody asked me in that video uh, if $28 a share was a good buy. And I said, I, I said, I think so, but I could see this price falling down to about $24. And then who knows? I, I think that's as low as it'll go. And I'll take a little bit of credit here. I was about a dollar and a half off it. Last week it went down to $22.50 about. And so then today, Man, today, what a day. Tw up 21.34%, and then after hours, up 3.62%. I don't know what tomorrow brings, but I would say that today was a good sign for the future of this stock. Because I've mentioned this before, we have Citron Research, and what do they do? I, I seriously think they make a business of looking at what's on Wall Street bets and making a price prediction in the opposite direction of what we're saying on that subreddit. And so they did this with NEO. They did this with other, other stocks. And so what happened with NEO? NEO went down for a little bit, and then it bounced right back up. And what's happening with Palantir? Palantir went down for la all of last week, and then it's bouncing right back up. And if any of those other predictions from Citron Research are a sign, then we are off to the races for at least this week, but maybe even next week. And we'll see. So what did I do? I bought calls last week. I, it's like clockwork with Citron. And I really think this. They bet against us and the stock goes down for a little bit and then it bounces right back up. So what I did, I, I prepared. I bought calls last week and those calls are looking to be quite lucrative right now and so we'll see where this goes i think over these next few days that things are looking good and so what happened today that caused the stock to jump like this one i, I think it is this pattern that we're talking about the pattern of citron betting against us the stock tanking and then jumping right back up really quickly but two a lot of people have been talking about this. Palantir closes up 21% on report of a $44 million FDA contract. And so, listen, $44 million isn't a big deal. That's nothing, it's nothing to be excited about except for the fact of this, all right? Palantir keeps doing this. And it's not just happening in the United States, it's happening in the UK, and it's going to be happening in the rest of the world. And so one $44.4 million contract isn't going to make much of a difference. But you know, you get a 100 of these all over the world. And all of a sudden, we're talking about massive revenue increases. I mean, Palantir is up 44% year over year, up 52% from the previous quarter. And I really believe at the next earnings report, report that they will be up 60 to 70 percent from the previous fourth quarter and so that's what happens with palantir and that's why i'm saying get in now now is a great time to get in because this stock a year from now will be worth much more than it is now okay so 44 point million not a big deal 
what, several 44-point million contracts? That is a huge deal. And that's what has me fired up about this stock. So get in now. Or if you want to wait for any kind of dip, I mean, with NEO again, people wanted to get in at $30, but they were afraid that it was going to tank. And so they waited for the dip. But when, the, when did the dip come? The dip came after it reached $50. And so you're going to do that. You're just going to wait for a dip and then you're going to buy. All right. You know, maybe that's the right call, but I'm happy. I would be happy to buy a call today or tomorrow morning. What have you? Are we off to the moon? Maybe, maybe when we went up to outer space and then we circled the planet a little bit and now we're off to the moon. I don't know, but I think we're off to the moon. So if you're fired up, I want to hear it. Let me know in the comments. And as always, please, a great way for you to support this channel is to hit the like button and subscribe to the channel. But I want to interact with you. Let me know what you think. Where are we going with Palantir? All right, guys, that's it for today. I just wanted to talk about this, and I hope you have a good week. I hope you make tons of money. I'm fired up. I feel good. Peace.